Welcome back to the Shield Network, or if it's your first time, welcome to the Shield Network. I am your host, Bad News Harris, and let me get a better visual. Try that again. I am your host, Bad News Harris, and I am here to talk about speed duels. Because Konami just announced the end of the speed duel line. So, let's talk about it. Because, see, uh, they announced a, a bit ago that the speed duel Battle City Finals was going to be released later this year. Uh, when it, I first saw it for Battle City Finals, I just thought that they were finishing off Battle City, and then the next set was going to be for Season 4. Um, see, they don't even have a thumbnail photo for it yet. They've got info on all the Battle City stuff that we're um, getting are going to get. It's like pre-build decks for Yami, Yugi, Kaibo, Joey, Mai, Bakura, Odeon, Ishizu, and Merrick. Kind of sad that they don't have Lumis and Numbra. I mean, a wasted opportunity just to reprint the mask cards for no reason, but whatever. Brand new skill cards. And additional cards to expand your speed duel collection. Ooh, a set of prismatic secret rares of Slifer, Obelisk, and Raw. 30 prismatic secret rares to add to your collection. See, the prismatic secret rares are pretty sick looking. Ooh, Joker's Knight, Lava Golem, Medora. Doom Caliber Knight's going to look really nice with that. Same thing with Breakthrough Skill. <gasps> Wait. Maxi is coming back in speed duel? Is that a is that a foreshadow that we're seeing here? The nine random prismatic secrets are included in each box. And see, I still need some common Ari attacks from uh from back in the day because my Thunder Dragon decks uh, use common Ari attack, but I still can't find any. Anyway. You see, it looks like we're getting some pretty sick-looking shit, especially with Max C coming in here, even if it's not going to be legal for the TCG that we know of. But it's still going to look sick, and I'm going to want some. But if we move over to their Instagram for the official Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG, uh, they made the announcement here, where it says, Announcement! With the release of the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG Speed Duel Battle City Finals, the initial Speed Duel saga we started a few years ago will be concluding. While we are including new content like Noah, Duke, and Tristan, the Speed Duel releases are starting to retread a lot of familiar ground, so the product will or the product line will be pausing for a rest. As always, Speed Duel cards will be legal for TCG play, and there will be continued OP support for Speed Duel so that duelists can continue to play with the format. Now, see, it's kind of a sh I, I, I understand it because the Speed Duel wasn't making a whole lot of money because it's basically Duel Links in physical form. And as much as people complained about modern Yu Gi Oh! and Duel Links and Speed Dueling is basically just the old school Yu Gi Oh! I'm surprised it didn't kick off like it kind of should have. But then again, the Yu-Gi-Oh! fan base is impossible to to satisfy. So I guess it's not too big of a surprise. It's really unfortunate though, because even with it treading uh some like retreading some content, I mean going into season four, there's plenty of stuff that they could do with it. I mean, hell, the Silvory Calcos would look sick in speed dueling. But whatever. It's their choice, their prerogative, and I imagine it'll make room for them to be able to make more product. Because we all know how much Yu-Gi-Oh! has been shoving out product the last couple of years. But, at least it was a fun run. Uh, I'm still going to collect some Speed Duel stuff because some of my fr uh, some of my friends that I don't get to see, but I, I hope to see uh, in the future soon. Uh, Speed Duel cards would help us be able to play old school Yu-Gi-Oh! a lot easier. Because it's really hard to find old school stuff nowadays. As I was referencing with the Kaminari attacks. I can't find those at all. And no, I'm not about to just go online and buy them directly. I mean, it's not like I go to tournaments so I can wait. I'm just impatient. Not the point. Point is, it's just unfortunate that Speed Duel is dying. 
But hey, why should I be surprised my childhood's been dying recently? Power Rangers is officially dead, so... Yay. Oh, well. Um, even with Speed Duel uh, going on a break, uh, we still have uh, Duel Links. I say uh, a lot in my videos. I am so sorry. But we do still have... Uh, God damn it, there I go again. We still have Duel Links and Rush Duel. It's basically the same. Well, it's literally the same as Speed Duel because Speed Duel is just a physical version of it. So we still have that to play, and Duel Links has a pretty pretty decent sized fan base. So it's not like Speed Duel is actually dying, dying. It's just a physical version of it's dying. No biggie. But hey, it was a fun run. Still gonna get a couple of decent uh, decent looking cards out of this before the uh, the line dies down, and then after that. It's basically just me collectors about or collectors items, and as we can all see, Bad News Harris loves to collect. So we'll see how that goes. We'll see how the cards look, and as soon as I see some out on the shelves, I'll start busting some open on the con or on the channel. Uh, but until then, that's it for for this video. That's all I want to talk about. Thanks for joining. Like, share, subscribe. Bad News Harris out.